Hello, and thanks for stopping by to view Put It Forward's Oracle Marketing Cloud, or Eloqua, to Salesforce integration. Put It Forward is the solution that is used to integrate applications amongst each other. In the instance of Oracle Marketing Cloud and Salesforce, this allows for the enrichment of contacts, campaigns, custom data objects, connecting leads and contacts with accounts and other activity inside of Salesforce. As we take a look, we begin to create a test contact here inside of Eloqua. We know some of the fields that we're going to want to integrate, but let's just go ahead and fill out some basic ones. These ones might be similar or related to the ones that we will select inside of Put It Forward to have integrated. Now, I've already created the connector inside of Put It Forward, and I want to showcase the information being transferred across first. Then we can walk through the connector itself. We've just created our contact. Let's go ahead and refresh this page and reload the information. Now we have our David test, a test contact here inside of. Oracle Eloqua. We've checked the information, let's go ahead and click Save, and from here, let's go ahead and move along and click on Put It Forward. Within Put It Forward, we now have the connector pre-built from before, and let's go ahead and run this connector. Click Save and Exit. It shouldn't take too long for the information to roll over as we do have it set in real time, but while it is doing so, we're going to test to see the search results and see if anything has come up. It seems as though that this information has not been broadcasted over just yet. But as it won't take too long, let's go and take a look and research again. And we should have our contact available for us here inside of Salesforce. Hit the search bar and let's type in the name. And as you can see, David Test was now imported from one side, Oracle Eloqua, to Salesforce. The information we have linked were the fields that were necessary. And inside to put it forward, we have dictated that first name, last name goes to name, and as well as that other information. Let's actually take a look inside the connector and see how this is possible. We'll head to the Properties page, and we're going to go ahead and select our source property, which in this case is Oracle Eloqua. I've selected it at the top, and I'm going to scroll, and I'm going to select Next. From within here, we can actually set the properties based on this connection that we are needing. As we select the parent data object for things like contact, campaigns, custom data objects, different various parent objects, we can also select a child data object. This might be things like city, country, first name, last name, you know, some of the properties we saw in the connection that are related to this contact level of information. Let's go ahead and go to the destination, select Salesforce, and let's do the same for that. We know that we want first name, last name, email address, and some very basic properties, but we want to make sure that this is on the contact level, and as well as that, the associated child categories as well. As you can see here, this would be things like email, first name, last name, and other varying data properties. Since this connector was already created beforehand before we ran this integration for you, we can see the mappings here. They are unified from one side to the other. Just as an example though, this is a version of our older designer. Let's take a look at the new designer and see what it's all about. As you can see here, properties are lined up and allow you to see the information as it is going forward and being passed along between the two applications. Put It Forward itself is all about making things easier and connecting applications amongst each other. Currently, we service well over 300 different applications, but that is always growing every day. This is just a microcosm or an example of just how many different types of applications and the types of data that can be integrated. Once you've seen one thing on one side, it's virtually the same for all of our applications. In this case, it's as simple as configuring the information, selecting your properties, and having that data move along. I thank you for coming by to view this video, and we hope to hear from you soon. Have a great day.